What's up, YouTube? Cold Ass Ice Cream is coming at you from Minnesota. And today I'm at the Twin Cities Veggie Fret. Sorry. Twin Cities Veggie Fest. As you all know, I'm vegetarian, so hanging out with a bunch of vegetarians and vegans today. Twin Cities Veggie Fest. I think that's upside down. <laughs> Peace. You guys, I feel horrible. Um, actually, I'm feeling better than what I was feeling. Um, yeah, not feeling too good, but kind of made myself get out. Supposed to do some other things this weekend, but I didn't. Uh, I didn't do it. Oh man, I love jewelry. I honestly don't know where to start at. So much stuff. And I'm not going to be able to edit these videos from the shaking because uh, I used to edit my videos on YouTube. YouTube had a, um, had a, um, I forget what it was called, video video something or another where you could edit your um, videos like from shaking and walking and stuff like that and you could change the color or whatever but now they don't even have that no more I don't know why they took that away <clears throat> looks like people are getting uh, some good uh, oh jasmine deli Mmm, this looks good. Lemongrass tofu noodles, um, steam ball, steam rice cakes, sticky rice, vegan roll, yum. Pineapples. Sorry, just cutting through. Your lipstick is beautiful. Thank you, it's Rihanna. Um, oh, it's gorgeous. I forget the name of it, but yeah. Thank you. Wow, they got all types of good stuff. Hi, how are you? Ten bucks. Cash or credit. Oh, Hi. yummy. They're delicious. Thank you. Yeah, we have these four packs available today. Um, do you want to hear about the flavors? No, I don't want it. I, I can't even taste or smell right now. I'm so clogged up. Oh, no. Thank you. <clears throat> Fig and taro. Uh oh, she wants to get at him. Oh. <laughs> nice, man. All kind of good stuff here. I'm sorry if y'all can't see good because I'm the sun. You know what? It was like 91 degrees when I left home um, in my part of town. Whoop! <laughs> my hat flew off with my bandana. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hey, y'all, my hat just flew off. <laughs> good thing I braided my hair before I left home. <laughs> Oh my goodness. But anyway, everybody's having a good time here at the Veggie Fest. All the. Yum, yeah, look at this. Shoot, I think I'm going to try and bring my falafels here next year. Shoot, why not? I make some pretty good vegetarian. Huh? What's that, baby? Here we go. Evan's Organic Eatery. Oh, okay, right cool. There, downtown St. Paul. Yeah. Um, everything's vegan, non-GMO, cook fresh every day. Come stop by. We always got music on. We're hanging out. The vibes are good. So. Okay, thank you. you Ordered a chicken sandwich from here uh, for eleven dollars. <laughs> but oh well, what the hell? I didn't pay for parking. I got the park for free. So there you go. Why not? Before I left home today. I cut open a watermelon that I had. I got it for $1.99 at um, first time. And I brought like uh, three pieces with me. 
And then so over there, when I was getting my sandwich, there was a little girl who was like all sad and depressed. I think she was suffering from um, maybe heat exhaustion or something. And so she was sitting on the ground just suffering. And then her mom was like, do you want some water? And she's like, no. And then I go, well, <laughs> I have watermelon in my purse. I know that sounds crazy, but would you like some watermelon? And then she's like, yeah. She, she, she was like, yeah, I'll take some watermelon, you know what I mean? And then, um, mm, I don't want to get it on my shirt. And then I told her about the story of um, how the um, slaves in America would eat the watermelon to basically stay alive. And um, I said, don't be ashamed of ever eating watermelon in public because um, it's an honor and a privilege to be able to eat it. You know, because um, the slaves would eat the watermelon to stay alive because it gave them nourishment and it gave them electrolytes and it um, hydrated their body and it made their tummies full. And think about it, they were working in the hot sun from sunrise until sunset. So this is what kept the slaves alive so that we could be here today in 2018. So eat the damn watermelon. <laughs> eat the watermelon anime, eat the watermelon. <laughs> Mmm. Homemade pickles. Mmm. I need a fork. <laughs> Y'all, this is all vegan food. Or vegetarian, whatever. Mmm. Look at that. Okay, I'm finna eat. I'm finna get all greasy faced and shit. So, yeah, I'm I'm finna I'm finna eat. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Mock duck, kimchi fries, empanadas, chimichangas, Vietnamese vegan egg rolls. Excuse me. Okay, so she's got sauces over here. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, there's only ones that are vegan and I don't know. <laughs> I'll try spicy. Alright, that spicy one's got your name on it right here. Just okay. I don't even like carrots, but I'll give it a try. Thank you. We just cover all the bases. You know what guys, I don't even like carrots, but I do want to eat the chip and try the chip. And it tastes really good. And it's not spicy, it's just a little little spice at the back of my throat. I like spicy. Help to get the cold out of me. Mm. I'm gonna go home and make me some um some ginger tea anyway y'all this is organic um, frozen yogurt every place has such a long line and anybody who knows me knows I love festivals I'm a festival whore <laughs>
that told you guys. I'm sorry. I got information down there um, at that little place right there called a meditation center. I always see their post on uh, Facebook, but I haven't been able to go because um, asking there and then uh, I think Shaska, Minnesota, or somewhere, which is kind of a drive for me. But um, I'm thinking about taking up some of their um, retreats which are like three-day events so that will be okay to do but yeah just making my way around the square stopping at a few places here and there just to talk to some uh, different um, organizations that I've seen on Facebook and different places like that raw vegan protein bar you know what? I can taste a little bit. <laughs> I'm kind of wanting to taste that herbivore um, butcher that's over there when I first came in. Um, only because I've heard so many good reviews about that place. And I kind of really want to give it a try. This is drinks and things. You know, one thing I haven't seen out here today, I haven't seen any kombucha. I gotta sit down somewhere and take off my shoes because I gotta. Feels like some grass or some gravel in my sandals. I, I see this guy with this pink hair and I had to stop him. So, what's up with the hair, dude? Uh, it's my favorite color. And so I've been doing this for years. <laughs> Cool, I love it. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Too. Oh, and we got turquoise over here. <laughs> right, so this is a sample of a vegan crab cake, and I'm gonna taste it and tell you how I like it. Here we're having a cooking demo with Coco and Lala. They're doing, um, I believe it was corn chowder. I might be wrong. I might have not been paying attention. <laughs> I think it's corn chowder. But yeah, we're having a cooking demo. And so you can find Coco and Lala on Facebook and I believe also YouTube. Mmm. It has a lot of dill in it and I love dill. I grow dill in my garden. Mmm. I like it. Because I don't even like crab cakes. I never used to like crab cakes back in the day, but I like this. So I'm not sure why a cow is here, but <laughs> let's find out. <laughs> so so why is why is a cow here? I'm sure there's an explanation. Uh, uh, I'm here on behalf of Forrester. Uh, so it's an animal sanctuary located up in Winston. Oh, nice. Um, so it's one of those where we can bring a real cow. So we this <laughs> oh, it's a sanctuary. Yes, yeah. So 13 animals right now. And um, basically, we just give them a place to kind of live out their lives. That's wonderful. It's where? Up in Winston, Minnesota. So up okay. here, kind of forest lake. Oh, that kind of that's wonderful. Yeah. I'm going to look it up. I'm yeah. sure it's on YouTube or something like that. Yeah, and Facebook and yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. I just had to ask. <laughs> you too. It's a beautiful day here in St. Paul, Minnesota. But I don't feel too good, so... <clears throat> I'm going to make my way home. But it's a beautiful day. Princess, coming at you from Minnesota. As always, grace and peace. <laughs>